Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. This is going to be a very fun, sexy video that I have um, decided to do for my ladies and for my men that are feet enthusiasts and just like to see a beautiful woman walking in beautiful heels or a man that his lady need to learn how to walk in heels. Here go a couple tips from me, yours truly, Leah Lee. Um, if you are not subscribed to my channel, make sure you go ahead and click the subscribe button on corn on corn. Let me show you no lipstick on my teeth. Hold up. All right, I had to fix my little mirror right there so I could see myself as I'm filming because I'm not sitting directly in front of my mirror right now. But anyway, yeah, go ahead and click the subscribe button. Help, let me know if I helped you. Let me know in the comments down below. Um, you know what I'm saying? Because I've seen a lot of comments on a previous video that I did about me walking in heels. How I became so comfortable um, with walking in heels, with my height. A lot of people were asking me what my height was. Blah, say blah. It was a lot of different questions, so it definitely made me want to do this video even more especially with valentine's day being tomorrow so um yeah i'm just gonna jump right ahead into this video with some tips and then at the end y'all are going to see how well i walk in heels i guess and uh yeah so let's get it so first um i have a couple things on my phone that i want to make sure that i hit everything um so first and foremost I have always loved uh, wearing heels even when like I was a kid of course like you know you play like your mom's shoes and stuff like that and when I was younger my mom was always wearing heels because of her jobs like she was always like managers or something where she had to dress professional so she always had heels growing up I still wanted to wear heels play dress up in heels blah 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 duh who cares fast forward into my adult life um, even into like college, you know what I'm saying? My those years, I still wore heels. I was still figuring out what heels were for me and how I felt with my height. I'm five six with no heels on. With heels on, depending on the heel, of course I'm going to be taller, taller than your average male because studies say your average male is five nine, which to me is truly short. I did not know that was the average. I thought the average was maybe like at least 5'11". So, um, you know, with heels on, I'm definitely taller than most males. So, um, dancing, let's go ahead and go into that. Dancing, stripping definitely got me comfortable with wearing taller heels because you don't want to be wearing no baby kitten heels and dancing thinking you cute because everybody going to be like, what is she got on? Like, shorty, what you got on though? So, um, yeah, for all of you that do not know, I know you're like dancing, stripping. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Er, yes, I did dance. It's about to come up on a one year anniversary that I have stopped dancing. And let me tell y'all, it's been a long year. But anyways, definitely dancing got me used to wearing heels, wearing taller heels and being taller than everybody in the club for the most part. Um, unless there was somebody that was tall or a woman that had heels on too. So yeah, and dancing heels, that the ones that I wore, were definitely on an average 5.5 to 6.5 inches. Just because it was like the platform and then the enormous heel, you know what I'm saying? That platform definitely gives you like four, like three and a half inches or something like that. So the total arch had to be like six inches or something i think i had measured my heels one night and i was like damn these is really tall but um yeah i was comfortable in um you know it just came kind of natural of course my feet hurt so at the end of certain nights and stuff but other than that i was good shoot my feet hurt at the end of the night wearing regular heels so that helped sorry if y'all hear that mexican music my neighbors is wilding right now like it's the middle of the week i understand it's hump day but it's the middle of the week turn that music down and you know what i'm saying let me work but on to the next one um a tip for you ladies and for you gentlemen men that may wear heels um whoever is wearing heels choose a heel that is comfortable for you don't be out here trying to wear no skinny skinny stiletto heel if you know you're more of a thicker heel woman or thicker heel person you know what i'm saying like don't be out here trying to wear the skinty 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 so k red bottom 
and you out here supposed to be wearing wedges. Like, there's nothing wrong with wedges. You just have to decide what shoe is for you. Which one are you going to be able to last in at the day party and at the brunch? And not have you taking off your shoes at the, you know what I'm saying? Let's that's, that's play it out. Hello? So, um, yeah, just choose a heel that you feel good in, you feel comfortable in. Go heel shopping. See which ones you feel better in. If you feel better in a, a, a shorter heel, then wear a shorter heel if you were if you feel better in something that gives you ankle support make sure you have your heel that gives you some ankle support like there's nothing wrong with finding your unique style and finding what you're comfortable to wear and you feeling sexy and good in ladies practice makes perfect almost perfect close to perfect you just really have to, like I said, see what heel is best for you and practice in it. Make sure sometimes new heels, depending on the brand, can have like that slippery uh, outside sole, like the bottom of the sole. So make sure you scratch that up on some concrete. Make sure you feel good and sturdy. See if you could drop down and get your eagle on real quick. Make sure you can come back up because if you can't, don't drop down, honey. Just put your hands on your knees, elbows on your knees and get to twerking. Or, you know, do whatever you do. Sit down and look cute. Because that's what I got to do sometimes when my feet start hurting. But just make sure you find the heel that you definitely are comfortable in. Practice makes perfect. Walk around in them in the house sometimes. Wear that heel for the next couple times that you go out. You know what I'm saying? Like, you have to stay steady with certain heels to get comfortable with them. Because... It just is like that. Like, it's like with anything, honey. You gotta practice. You gotta practice. You gotta practice. You gotta wonder where those heels be, be girl. I feel like some people are naturals at wearing heels and being comfortable in heels and heels being their primary go-to shoe to go out most of the time in. I feel like I'm a natural at wearing heels, but don't get it twisted. My feet be freaking hurting. I can play it off for a certain extent depending on how the night is going. If it's not a whole lot of walking going around, then I'm good. But if it's a lot of walking, honey, I'm gonna be, yo, I'm not gonna be on your your friends list that night. I'm just be like, I'm ready to sit down. Um, can we please find a chair? Let me go see if I can find somebody's booth. I can go sit down in and get a drink. Um, or I'm sitting at somebody's bar. I'm sitting somewhere because, baby, listen, my feet be hurting sometimes. But, yeah, some people are natural at wearing heels. I know that some girls, they wear heels like every single night they go out. And I'll be like, I can't wear heels every single night. I can't. I cannot do that. Um, like, every time I go out, I like to be comfortable, 100% comfortable sometimes. And with that comes sneakers and sandals. Most of the time, sandals. So, yeah, some people are natural, some people are not. Some people just, heels are a no-go for them. They do not wear heels. That is just not their thing. And that's okay. To each his own. Um, lastly, before I get this clip started with me walking in these heels, honey, doing my little cat while Victoria's Secret theme. The average heel that I wear is around four to four and a half inches. Whether I don't wear platform heels like to go out in, that was only a dancing thing because that's how the shoes are made. Um, for the most part, I wear sandal heels. Um, I just purchased some closed toe pointy heels, like booties. If y'all know what I'm talking about, y'all about to see in this next clip. Hope y'all enjoy it. Let
Brian Little. <laughs> I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I definitely did. I love getting glammed up and looking cute for you guys. It's mostly for me, but for you guys too. If you did, make sure you thumbs this video up. Do not thumbs it down. Comment down below. Subscribe and turn your notifications on. I love y'all. Tomorrow's Valentine's Day, so I'm about to be getting... I'm about to be getting real cute. You guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Talk to y'all later.